Finally tonight, love and football. You can have one without the other, but it's also very nice to combine them. And it happened at last night's Fiesta Bowl. The game was David, Boise State, against football Goliath, Oklahoma. And at the end, there was exciting football and storybook romance. Here's ABC's David Muir. They were the Broncos from Boise, facing the storied Sooners from Oklahoma. And with seven seconds left, the Sooners had a one touchdown lead. But Boise, with one last play, pulled off a schoolyard trick play, one of the oldest in the book. They were very widely underestimated. It was the hook and ladder. The quarterback passes to one player, who surprises everyone and laterals to another. The lateral! The player that catches the ball just pitches it to him, and then pretty, uh, pretty open sailing. And sail he did, right into the end zone. Then overtime, the final seconds, and Boise State again down by one. In desperation, they turned to yet another trick for a two-point conversion. They had no clue it was coming. The Statue of Liberty. The quarterback fakes a throw with one hand, wrapping the ball behind his back with the other. Running back Ian Johnson runs it to the end zone and helps the boys of Boise win. But Ian's biggest play was yet to come. He turned to Boise's cheerleading captain, his girlfriend, and popped the question. At first, she couldn't hear what he said. What was he thinking? I hope she says yes quickly because they might cut away from this and <laughs> might say, think she said no. <laughs> yes! Then came the final tackle of the game. But just one thing was missing from the playbook, the ring. I didn't really care. <laughs> I was just excited that he asked me. She now has that ring on her pinky. It didn't fit, but the rest of the game plan sure did. David Muir, ABC News, New York. And may the football star and the cheerleader live happily ever after.